Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here with another quick tutorial. Today I'm going to show you guys how to resolve if your Windows Media Player library is corrupt. So this is going to be a pretty straightforward tutorial and we're going to just jump right into it. So you want to open up the start menu and type in services. Should be listed as a desktop app on Windows 10. You want to open that up. So now I'm going to blow this thing up full screen here. I'm going to expand the view for the name and we're going to head down until we get to Windows Media Player Network Sharing Service right here and you want to right click on it and we can see that it's already been stopped for some reason if it says automatic over here for startup type and you want to right click on it and the option to stop is not grayed out you want to gray that option out so by clicking on stop you want to make sure that's stopped once you're done doing that, you want to close out of the services window. And then you want to head back over to the start button, right click on it, and then left click on run from this menu. Now you want to type in percent sign local app data. Local app data should all be one word. Another percent sign backslash Microsoft. Another backslash, and then hit enter. So now where it says media player, you want to right click on it and then select delete. Now this will initiate Windows to start rebuilding your media library. It's not, it should not delete your music so you should not have to worry about that. So at this point you just would go back in the start menu and you would try and open up Windows media player. And everything should be working fine at this point. So I hope this brief tutorial helped you guys out, and I will catch you in the next tutorial. Goodbye.